Hi, welcome to Noor's Garden and Kitchen. I am Noor, and we're going to go over butter chicken. Oh. Okay. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> it's Cammy, my son's um, friend. She wants to learn butter chicken, so she came over here today to learn butter chicken. So we all gonna learn together today. Okay. So we'll be doing butter chicken today. So this is a very famous dish. Everybody goes to India rest restaurant. I think they always order butter chicken. So yeah. I have a lot of requests for the butter chicken. So I decided to make butter chicken today. So okay, let's see what we needed. All the ingredients for the to make butter chicken. It's gonna be two phases. One is gonna be chicken. We are gonna be uh, marinating chicken separately, and then we're gonna let it sit down for a half an hour. Then we are gonna go to the gravy. It's gonna be two steps. Okay, to make butter chicken. We need uh, chicken, of course. I have two pounds of boneless chicken breast. You can use any part of the chicken. Uh, you can use uh, legs and with the bones or anything, but I am using uh, breast. And I have a two tablespoon of garlic and ginger. And I have some salt, one spoon of salt. And I have some lemon juice. I'm gonna use like a two to three spoon of lemon juice. I have turmeric. Uh, one maybe half a spoon then I have a garam masala half a spoon I have um, coriander powder one spoon cumin powder one spoon red chili powder half a spoon I have two tablespoon of Kashmiri red chili powder uh, that's just gonna give the color so we are not gonna make uh, butter chicken very spicy butter chicken is never be spicy so just uh, it's a flavor is gonna come with the other spices okay it's not going to be hot and also I have uh, about three tablespoon of uh, yogurt I hang the yogurt and remove all the uh, water so the water uh, yogurt is so thick so we're gonna have that so let's mix everything marinate uh, and leave it for two three hours then we're gonna cook chicken okay okay uh, first we are gonna Take this chicken and put some lemon juice. Yeah, so that much, about three spoons probably. And then uh, I'm gonna have uh, garlic and ginger paste. I'm mixing garlic and ginger paste, two spoons. And then the salt. turmeric, garam masala, allspice, coriander powder, cumin powder, Kashmiri red chili powder, just for the color, and red pepper, and some yogurt. I'm gonna put all three spoons of yogurt in there. So it's so thick. If you have a Greek yogurt, you can use that Greek yogurt. I don't have the Greek yogurt, so I used it um, regular yogurt, but I removed the water from there. So it's kind of thick. So we just have to mix all these ingredients and then marinate for three to four hours. And then I'm gonna add two to three spoons of cooking oil. Mine is canola, or you can use any oil. Okay, oil is marinating. We can start making a gravy, okay? Okay. To make gravy, we need some fresh and red tomatoes. Try to take uh, very red tomatoes and I took medium size six tomatoes. And also I have one large onion 
and I have some kasuri methi, fenugreek leaves and some salt, maybe one spoon. And then I have a garam masala, half a spoon. I have coriander powder, one spoon, cumin powder, one spoon, and red chili powder, uh, half a spoon, and Kashmiri red chili powder, one spoon, and some cashew nuts, and of course we need butter for butter chicken. It's going to cook in the butter, and then we have some heavy whipping cream. We're going to put on the top, and I'm using a little bit of oil. Okay, let's go start cooking. Okay, I add some oil and about three tablespoons of butter. Then I'm gonna add onions. Let's fry these onions for a little while until the onion gets a little softer. I can even add cashew nuts to fry with it with the onions. We'll take few minutes to onions to get soft. Then we're gonna add tomatoes and rest of the spices. Okay, onions are soft. I'm gonna add the tomatoes. And all of these spices. Uh, I forgot to add garlic, so I'm going to add a couple of cloves of garlic, <coughs> okay? And we're going to let it cook for a little while. I'm going to add some water. Let it cook for until all the tomatoes get soft and the onions get soft. So then we're going to grind everything together. Then it's going to be making gravy. So let me add some water. Okay, I'm going to be adding too much water, just a little bit of water to this. Okay, we'll cover this and let it cook until all the vegetables and cashews every get soft and cooked, okay? Okay, let's cook chicken. I'm going to put some oil in the pan. Spread the oil. And we're going to put all this chicken in there. Marinated chicken. Okay, tomatoes and onions are soft, so I turn the stove off. I'm gonna let it cool down, so then we can grind. Okay, and the other stove, I'm cooking the chicken. So as soon as the chicken is done and the gravy is ready, we are gonna mix it together. Okay. Okay, our chicken is 
ready so all the water is evaporated and chicken is ready so we are going to smoke this chicken in a pan okay our chicken is ready all the water is evaporated we are going to be giving some smoke to the chicken barbecue flavor so we are going to put some charcoal in there I burned some charcoal on other stove so I'm going to put it in there turn the stove off and we will put a little bit of oil in there so it's going to give it a little bit more smoke in there so while it's smoking we can um, grind this gravy in the grinder okay let me go grind this I will come back Okay, our chicken is ready and also I grinded all the gravy so now we have to strain this so all the seeds and uh, tomato seeds and uh, skin will come off a bit the creamy is gonna uh, the butter chicken means it's not just the butter it's like a structure creamy structure so once you run it through this, it's gonna be the gravy is gonna be like a butter, it's gonna be creamy, nice. So okay friends. Um uh, I strain all the gravy and just this right here is only tomato skin and the seeds left in there so then we are going to add chicken in there and cook for a little while so butter chicken will be ready see how creamy structure that's why it's called butter butter chicken structure has to be like this so creamy nothing in there and now we are going to add chicken we didn't give the smoke it's ready now okay okay so all the chicken is ready so or butter chicken so I'm gonna let it cook for 10 minutes then I'll come back and dish out I'm gonna show you how it's gonna look okay okay our chicken butter chicken is ready so we are gonna be so creamy I'm gonna turn the stove off then we can put this kasuri methi fenugreek leaves you just little smash it in between your palms and just put it in there and uh, stir it and uh, now look how creamy and nice butter chicken is ready see and we are going to add some heavy cream in there Over butter chicken is more creamier. Okay, uh, let me remove it in the dish. Let me dish out, then I'm gonna show it in the dish. Okay, okay, friends, our creamy butter chicken is ready to eat, and this goes very good with the. Uh, garlic naan i can give a recipe for the garlic naan one day or maybe it also goes very good with the vegetable pilau or just the pilau so it's uh, really try it make it and try it and comment and let me know how it is if you like it please click like share and subscribe 
and watch for my new videos every Sunday. Okay? See you all later. Bye.